So we're doing a review now. What's up, y'all? We watched the movie. It's one o'clock in the morning. It's it's late. We just, we have on a school morning. night. I have we have work. We have it is a school night. It's a school. Night. We both. But have that's okay. We tomorrow. were like, you know what? Let's just go to the movies. And I am glad we did. I brought I my blanket. Know. I was in my pajamas. <laughs> Cozy situation. The seats didn't move, but but it was IMAX. Which IMAX, was, the, the, those speakers were booming. It was. It was like it was booming. It like tickled my brain because we don't that's what we kept saying is we don't like get to I mean we have we can because we have like sound but you know it's not it's an experience to do the IMAXs anyway we watched Guardians of the Galaxy um volume 3 volume 3 I don't know yeah one of the more dramatic it was they did they like cuss a lot more was that what it was there was an F-bomb yeah, uh, it was like the first, right? Yes. I think you're gonna go to the right. Okay. Yeah, it's only like like ten minutes away from us, so it's fun, fun times. And uh, initial thoughts? Shall we um, go first? You want to go first? I. Uh, it was cool. It's a lot. It's a long movie. Surprisingly, did not need to go to the bathroom at any time, even though every time we go to the movies, I pull up my run pee app and it tells me the good times to go to the restroom. Oh, I went twice. Good for you. Uh -huh. Um, but it's cool. It's pretty, I mean, in, in a way it's kind of run of the mill a little bit. They, you, you know, the, for, the formula works, the humor and the, was, the epic, the epic was, walking in scene, the, yeah. the quirky, but like cool. percent of this movie as like not our main actors but then like we still have to shell out a lot of dough to like make all these effects like it's just oh. it's all Dude, you some, know some of the fight scenes were super dope it, uh, it like, was gratuitous like, yes gratuitous but i mean come on like come on it, it's it it's like come what on. i like about the guardians of the galaxy compared to like other marvel heroes is their powers aren't like over the top. They're sure, like, they're more like they're practical. Yeah, you know? they're more. They're still cool. They've got cool yeah. powers, but they're not they're like the, they're the quirky ones. Yeah, sure. They're the they're, under, underdogs. They're the quirky ones. And there's like a corridor scene that, that has like a spinning camera. I thought that was like mm -hmm. you know one of the most impressive. Like, it was. It was just really fun to like experience scenes. it audibly. Yes. And, and and visually, I mean, it's yeah, a big like, screen. Like when and the ship was moving, you felt the theater yeah, shape, like you're on the great. you're on the freaking ship. It's look at that. It's like it hasn't even been five minutes, and we're home. Like <laughs> this is going to be the shortest movie review ever. Be we're just going to have short reviews now because Honestly, we don't and have a lot of time. That, and, and that's okay. It, that mean, is okay. I, I think that if anything, that one thing I I didn't appreciate about the film was just Ooh, there's that a light here. Yay. They sort of, uh, they sort of did 
a few things, um, like, you know, they over dramatized some situations that I felt like were, were done already. Like, there's a scene where one character is out in space, and I'm like, yeah, but that happened in a previous Guardians film. I, I don't know. Like, I, well, I get it. What do you give? Okay. Uh, um, how many mixtapes do you give Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 out of 10? I'll give it an 8. An 8? I mean, it's like a, it's like a low 8, like light 8, I guess. Like That sounds perfectly fine to me. Mm -hmm. I also give it an 8, mm -hmm. and, and I'm not swayed by your your rating mm -hmm. at all. That's mm -hmm. probably what I was going to give it regardless, mm -hmm. because I, mm -hmm. I enjoyed the film immensely. Mm -hmm. I I um, will miss this series, but let's be real, James Gunn's style at this point has become very, like, overly done. Like, we're seeing so much James Gunn content, and his, his style is, like, it's starting to get, like, tired. Ooh, spicy words. Well, let's be real, okay. you know? Like, he... I, he's got a he's got a good style. Don't get me wrong. He revitalized like he he helped define like this like the superhero out there superhero genre. Mm -hmm. Um and and now he's going to DC and he's going to be doing some crazy things in DC and that's totally cool. Um and I think that'll work for him because it seems like he he does well even in like in dark stuff like Peacemaker. Anyway, it's late, y'all. Peace out, y'all. You can follow me at DJB underscore Remix, Instagram, Twitter, Twitch. There you are. Yep. Uh, and you can follow Rizaline B at Instagram and Twitch. Okay. I love you. Bye. Bye. I love you guys.